Hello, social media friends. I'm Viridiana Marquez with DRB Media Communications Digital News, and Danny Barrera has the story. At approximately 7.45 a.m., an employee with the Edgar County Sheriff's Office discovered a device that resembled a pipe bomb somewhere near the west entrance of the Edgar County Courthouse. The employee advised courthouse security of the discovery of the device and possible threat. It did appear to be a legitimate pipe bomb at that time, and uh, we, we uh, uh, employed the assistance of OPD's bomb unit and the ECISD bomb dog unit and uh, they responded uh, to the uh, OPD's bomb unit, uh, x-rayed the device, and ultimately uh, they rendered it safe with a, a water shot, which shoots a high pressure water stream at the device and, and, uh, and it perforates that, that device. And it perforated it, and at this time, we don't know that there's actually anything in there that, that uh, w would be dangerous, but it was devised in, in, the, uh, in the way that it, it would cause harm to someone because it was, it was uh, designed to make people think it was a, an explosive device. Several rumors surfaced that a cartel was responsible for the bomb threat. There are criminal trials currently scheduled at the Edgar County Courthouse. Uh, there, there are some trials going on. Uh, there was one criminal trial going on and we've contacted uh, some individuals in reference to that. Uh, we feel comfortable that no one involved in that uh, case is, is uh, involved and, uh, and we've got an, another couple of cases but we, we don't really know at this time if anybody in those uh, cases would be involved right now anyway. The ATF, FBI, and Texas Rangers are on the ground working with the Edgar County Sheriff's Office, reviewing video from cameras located at the Edgar County Courthouse and possibly from businesses near the courthouse, as well as other evidence collected at the scene. We, we have video. Uh, the video's not, uh, um, it's, it's not good enough that we can make an identification on somebody. It will use, be used as cooperation with other videos that we're obtaining right now throughout the downtown area. And uh, we'll, we'll just use all that for cooperation and, and, and uh, hopefully when we get this guy arrested, he'll go to jail for a long time. About 10.45 a.m., the Edgar County Sheriff's Office allowed employees and the public doing business at the courthouse to enter through the east entrance. We set up scanning equipment uh, near those east side doors so that uh, when the public arrived for business as usual, uh, that we go ahead and, and do, our, do our, our job, you know, scanning uh, for weapons and whatever uh, through that door. Uh, we're going we're gonna to keep that uh, west side uh, blocked off for the time being until we're sure that all evidence is collected and, and properly uh, logged into uh, to evidence so, so that we have a good case. Officers and investigators also checked the Arctic County Annex building for any possible threat. We did uh, uh, run the dogs through there and, and ran, ran our people through there just to, just, just to check. And, and we ran the dogs through the courthouse to, to make sure that uh, it was good and clear. We want all those employees to feel safe. Uh, returning back to work. This is an ongoing local, state, and federal investigation. There were no injuries during the bomb threat investigation. If you have information regarding a person or persons involved in this incident, contact Odessa Crime Stoppers at 432-333-TIPS or the Hector County Sheriff's Office at 432-335-3050. For DRB Media Communications Digital News, Danny Barrera. Thank you for following us on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and also at DRB Media Communications Digital News TV. For DRB Media Communications Digital News, Viridiana Marquez.